Good evening, Ed. Yeah, the thing that shocks you here, or at least stands out, is that this crowd is very young, mainly under 30, and very racially diverse. In addition to the people that have gathered here on the steps of uh, West Middle School, there are also people driving by, honking at times, uh, waving their fist in the air, uh, honking in support of the people that are at this peace rally. Several hundred people started gathering here in front of West Middle School just before 5 o'clock, most wearing black, nearly all wearing face masks, and insisting that this event will be peaceful. Brockton Mayor uh, Robert Sullivan asked the crowd to take a knee at one point, and they all did, and he asked them to say George Floyd's name, which they did. He also said that there have been rumors online about what might happen later tonight in Brockton. People might come to this community to try to create badness. Uh, it's unacceptable. That's not what coming together as a peaceful process is about. So we've taken precautions. Social media is not always accurate. We know that. We hope it's not. Some businesses nearby have started boarding up their entrances, including a CVS near the Brockton Fairgrounds. The crew there told us that they had four similar jobs lined up after this one. Now this event here at the school was originally supposed to be a march to Brockton City Hall, but the organizers decided to change that to keep it as a one location event so that in their words, they could better contain it. Live in Brockton, David Beanick, WCVB News Center 5.